Xactimate has changed. So we're going to show you the new way to download Xactimate for free. We're also going to talk about how the salary and the pay works with Xactimate jobs. But first, tales from the field. I would say, yeah, you definitely need a mold test up here. Yeah, you definitely need a mold test. estimating software that claims adjusters use. This is going to be used by 90% uh, of the companies that you go out there and work for. So if you want to be part of that percentage that actually has consistent work that is doing some high earning, you're not getting kicked off of your deployments first, the Xactimate program is where you're going to want to hone your skills. It's not easy to learn on your own. It's a brand new program. You have to understand measurements, angles, a little bit of math goes into it. You have to understand design, technology, software. So our videos give you a self-paced opportunity to do that. And that is going to launch you in your training skills and your ability to talk about the industry. You'll be helping not only insurance companies, you'll be helping homeowners and mitigation contractors, vendors, and the like. So you'll want to take a look at our this Xactimate training if you really want to boost yourself into a new career as a claims adjuster. $36,771 is going to be your nat national average, even more than what the claims adjusters were making. So here's Upwork. Look how much people are earning for Xactimate. Uh, this guy up here, he's doing 20 an hour. It's not that great. Uh, 25 is more what auto uh, adjusters might earn per hour. Next, we have this Jared. He's at 75. Let's see. Lisa has down here. She's earned over $20,000. I don't know what, over what time span, but if you're working from home, could you use the extra $20,000? I definitely want an extra $20,000. And then it's not so, I just showed you ZipRecruiter, right? I showed you Upwork. And now these are Google. Uh, no, this is simply apply web searches for jobs for people who are looking for claims adjusters. So you have different, um, you have different salaries here too, from Florida to Colorado, Maryland, who doesn't want to go to Hawaii, right? So they're looking for Xactimate, uh, Xactimate writers. Um, and then just Xactimate itself on Upwork. So the other one was ZipRecruiter. Then just searching for Xactimate, seven jobs uh, people want, $250 for, uh, $250, what do they want? Please contact me regarding this estimate. I have the measurements and can email them over, Preston. Let's see, $50 down there. Then you have 10 hours a week for Xactimate, 10 to 15, 10 to 30. You just got to use Xactimate. Here's the thing though. Um, I mean, right, Xactimate is awesome. We love it because you can earn even before you get your license. Then you use the money that you, you need, right, to then pay for any training that you need after your license. But get the license. I told everybody in February it would be great. Get the license. You will be run, running and ready to go to have your license um, ready for right now. And then all the training that's coming up, you will be able to attend that to be able to work the storm season. So it's a pattern. It's a step one, step two, step three that you have to file. Okay. Here's the only problem. Xactimate is $255 a month, a month. So that's more than my phone bill and uh, probably and some other bill. I mean, there's still some left over after a phone bill on, on that one. So it's $255 a month, but I'm going to show you how, to, I, I know they have the 30 days free. I'll show you how to extend that another 60 days, okay?
estimate that I just started drawing. I have to go back and redo this one because my measurements are off. And I use the wall tool here to draw this. And I just use the room tool here to place that box. So this uh, measurement is going to be the bathroom. So you just click on the title. This bathroom is 49 by 49. As you see, I need to adjust that. So I click that white little button on the side to get the adjacent measurements done. See, so click that white box to change that. If I'm moving too fast, please slow down the video or just let me know in the comments like, hey girl, I want to follow along, but you're just moving too fast. That's all you got to let me know. And you see, this really should be more flush with that wall but I still got to come back and change that anyway that's the bathroom the laundry room I'm going to use this tool that wall tool laundry room so this laundry room wall is three feet three and you can always draw your rooms separate they don't have to be together When I'm out in the field drawing, sometimes it just, and people are talking to you, especially if they uh, are very excited or in, into the industry, they want to know everything. So that wall is actually eight feet five inches, and this is six three. So again, to change the name of that, you could just type in a few letters. It takes the rest. It does the rest of the work for you. So that almost fits, right? This just needs to be probably about a little longer. And there's, see that? That's what I'm using to move. Okay. So of course, the wall isn't actually set up like that. So I'm just going to Bring that down to where it's even and merge these walls together. Laundry room it may not be perfect. Oop, that's a roof. May not be perfect, but it's close. Where's my measurements? Okay, here they go. The laundry room also had a closet, which is something I don't really see in most laundry rooms. I'm gonna hit R. You can click and drag the room if you like. Just showing you different ways for different levels. And it's 2-5 is where I'm going with this one. That is a closet. Again, you can just hit that button there. And to move it, you just drag that little yellow. I'm using the uh, external mouse. If you're using your mouse pad, like on your laptop, you won't be able to do that. Let me think, let me think. Okay, 